Look at Tess's family. Her eyes are as blue as her father's and grandfather's. Her hair is straight like her mother's, and her button nose is just like her grand aunt's. Why does Tess look so much like her parents and grandparents? Tess looks so much like her parents because she inherited traits like the color of her eye and hair from her parents. Her parents inherited these traits from their parents. What are inherited traits? Inherited traits are unique features that young ones get from their parents. Plants also inherit traits from the parent plants. For example, young tulip plants inherit traits and grow into tulip plants themselves. Animals like fish and birds inherit traits from one generation to the next. This is why all fish have fins and all birds have feathers. Organisms adapt to survive in a particular environment. This trait is passed from the parent to the offspring. The spines of the cactus are an adaptation that helps shade the cactus from the sun and prevent the loss of water from its surface. They also protect the cactus from hungry animals. This trait is passed down from one generation to the next. Musk oxen are well adapted to live in the Arctic region. They have two layers of fur that protect them from the extreme cold climate. A musk ox large, hard hooves break icy surfaces of water bodies to drink the water below. Their hooves are another example of adaptation. Look at this ptarmigan bird in summer and in winter. Yes, it's the same bird. The ptarmigan lives in the cold Arctic and has adapted by changing the color of its feathers from brown to white based on the season. Changing the color of its feathers from brown to white helps the bird blend into its surroundings and keeps it hidden from other animals. This is the spots on a leopard, the stripes on a zebra, the smelly spray of a skunk, and the long neck of a giraffe are all inherited traits. Hola, yo hablo español. Tess is learning to speak Spanish from her parents. She couldn't speak Spanish as a baby. Not all behavior is inherited. Some of it is learned by interacting with parents and others while growing up. We learn how to swim or ride a horse. We are not born with these skills. They have to be taught. Animals too learn from their parents. For example, tigers teach their cubs how to hunt for food. These chimpanzees learned how to crack open nuts by using rocks. This is a learned characteristic. Bottlenose dolphins teach their young how to cover their noses with sponge that grows on the ocean floor. The sponge protects their noses when they search for fish at the bottom of the ocean. Did the dolphin learn or inherit the ability to perform these tricks in the pool? It's a learned characteristic. Well done. Today, you learned characteristics that are passed on from the parents to their young ones are called inherited traits. Not all characteristics are inherited. Some characteristics have to be learned. Characteristics that are learned or acquired are called learned characteristics.